Good evening, everyone. Today we will discuss about cypressy and poesy. So before cypressy and poesy, we have to understand about the monocotyledonous. So monocotyledonous it means one cotyledon and endogenous growth, and these are the characters like macroscopic seeds, corolla-like flower, apocarpus, calyx-like flower, inferior ovary, glumaceous flower. Perianthales flower. In Glumaceous flowers, the important families are Poaceae, Cypressae, Iraculaceae, Restionaceae, Central Epicidaceae. You can observe here if we will talk about the Cypressae first, Angiosperm, then Monocot, then Glumaceous flower, then Cypressae family. Here, Cypressae it means stages. Poesy it means grasses, genesis it means rasses. So you can observe here the flower character. Okay, for poesy you can observe the lemma, genesis you can observe the tepal, sapresi you can observe the bracket, stigma, anther, filament, ovary. Here you can observe the stem character for poesy, the ring like structures. Triangular in Cypressi. Difference between grasses and sedges. You can observe in Poesy stem carrot, stem mostly hollow, seat open. For Cypressi, stem angular, stem solid, seat closed. Now, introduction to grasses Poesy. Root always fibrous arises from lower node, stilt roots present in some grasses. Rhizome underground stem, stolen, creeping stolen stem or cul aerial stems are hollow or flattened with hollow internode and solid node, nodes hairy or glabrous. So you can observe here spikelet also. So open sheath, this is the legule. You can observe stem, legule, leaf, and sheath. So leaf sheath originates from node of the stem and surrounds the clump. Leaf blade linear lanceolate with parallel venations. Legume thin membranous or fringe of hairs at the junction of sheath and blade. You can observe the legume in photograph. Grass flowers. So you can observe the one floret on the spikelet. Okay, these tiny flowers are protected by two bracts. Lower is the lemma and the upper is the pelia. On are present one lemma you can observe in the photograph. The flowers with its lemma and pelia is called a floret. The flower floret is always one flower with one lemma and one pelia. Sometimes pelia may be absent. Spikelet many floret. You can observe here see, this is the floret and this is the spikelet. The grass flower is very small, inconspicuous, and reduced. It consists of gynosium, endosium, and lodicules. The flower has two tiny basal scales called lodicules or reduced perianth. Perianth it means it has attached petals and sepals, glumes, rachilla, and one to many flowers together form a spikelet. Rachilla central axis, one which florets board. Glooms pair of bracts present at the base of a spikelet. You can observe the groom, gloom here in the green. Now, cypressy. This is the symmetric presentation of a spikelet, terminal spikelet, lateral spikelet. This is the cypressy flower. You can observe the involucral leaf inflorescence clusters of a spikelet. Bracts spirally imbricated, stem triangular, involucral leaf. Here you can observe the terminal spikelet, rhizome spike of the stages. Here you can observe the habit sketch and inflorescence of a rus. Some uh, important cypress like cypress rotundans. Cypress rotundans are very common. The tuber is used for the treatment of dysomonarial and menstrual irregularities. You can observe the flower. 
दिस इज द साइप्रस एस्क्यूलेटस और येलो नट सेज राइजोम्स आर कंसीडर्ड एज एनालजेसिक टॉनिक एंड एंटीबैक्टीरियल एजेंट दिस इज द साइप्रस डिफ्यूसस रूट इज यूज्ड अगेंस्ट इन्फ्लेमेशन साइप्रस इनवोल्यूक्रेट्स रूट इज यूज्ड अगेंस्ट इन्फ्लेमेशन साइप्रस हॉटिनेंसिस रूट इज यूज्ड अगेंस्ट मेंस्ट्रुअल इररेगुलरिटीज साइप्रस निवियस द राइजोम यूज्ड फॉर द ट्रीटमेंट ऑफ इररेगुलर मेंस्ट्रुएशंस दिस इज द साइप्रस डिस्टेंस साइप्रस साइप्रोइड्स telinga saprolytics root is used as a tonic for nervous system problem this is the scripus articulatus leaves are used for the treatment of for diarrhea it also indicate the natural mineral leak or salt leak thank you very much for this session